What's up guys, it's Jack Maker here from Dogs. Today I'm going to give you a video review and build of the brand new HT505 deck by District. This deck, the HT, comes in three different sizes. You've got the longest one which comes in at 550, the middle sized one which is 530, and the new one which is this one comes in at 505mm long and they all come in at 120mm wide. The head angle on these decks is 83 degrees which is perfect because that means you don't loop out as much as you would on other decks with less steep head tube angles. This deck comes fully integrated which is the standard for decks these days. The spacers for the back wheel are built into the brake in a quite a clever system where the brake slots into the back of the deck and the spacers sit in line with the axle holes so the axle just goes straight through and you don't have to faff around with spacers for ages. This is the hardest thing I've ever done in my life. This deck comes in at a total weight of 1,340 grams which is really lightweight for how big it is, as it is quite a wide deck. This deck is mostly based for more park riders, as it as because of the length it's quite short and the grind rails on the bottom are quite wide apart, which is good because it gives you a lot of balance when you're on rails or on or just doing any types of grinds. And because it's got the two here and here, as you'll see in a close-up, it um, allows you to lock into the coping really well, or whatever you're grinding on really well. Also, as there's not much metal that is actually touching the rail or coping, then it makes you grind better because there's less friction coming from less surface area. All in all, this deck is great all round because it's light, it's short, so which makes it whippier, and it's wide, so you've got a big base to land on, and head tube angles steeper, so you don't loop out, and it's just all round. It's just a very, it's just a good deck. So yeah. So now I'm going to be building it up with some of my own parts and some other new parts that have just come to the market, like these Aztec Redix forks which come black and silver, oversized so it fits HIC and SES, HIC being the chosen compression system to ride today. This deck is compatible with all types of compression, ICS, IHC, SES, HIC, whatever new ones there are out today. Yeah. Another new colorway that's just come to market of the crisp hollow core wheels. These are extremely light, coming in at 240 grams, including the bearing, which is honestly so light, considering most wheels weigh in around 400, 350 grams. So it is, these wheels, if you're a weight weenie like me, then these are the, these are the wheels that you want. The new colorways come in this color, black and neochrome, or a black and polished. And there are also all the older colours. These bars, I've been running them for a while now. They are the Kota Titanium Signature Bars. They're ridiculously light, obviously, as they're titanium. And they come 24 high by 24 wide. Compatible with HIC, or if you cut the slit off, compatible with SES as well. These are coming out next year sometime. On the top of these bars, I'm running the District Rope Grips. They're extremely soft and they've lasted a long time. Every time I go to the skate park and someone goes on my scooter, they always say how good these grips are and ask what they are. They are District Rope Grips. That is what you want. They're also coming out in the near future sometime. I think that's it, just the headset. It's just a standard, just standard bearings, no brand, just they're just bearings. Let's get building. As I've been making this custom, 
I've realised that the bolt in the Aztec forks are, is actually a size 6 bolt, which means it's wider than the than these bolts, which is a size 5. So that means that your compression will come loose less often. Does that make sense? So it won't, it won't, <laughs> so it will come loose less. <laughs> fresh it's just it's just really nice the neochrome core of the wheel gives the whole scooter a nice pop of color just to make it all just just looks really good really very 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 nice so now I'll be riding the, this this scooter for for a while to see how it's like see what all the parts are like all the new ones I'm sure it will hold up nicely so now, I'm going to get some clips on this bad boy. See you at the skate park. It's just so painful.